hello loves welcome back to my channel and welcome to my channel if you are new here so today i will be bringing you my asof haul if you don't know i am duquana white i bring you plus size fashion content as well as lifestyle and beauty content and i do asof hauls every single week i just love the new arrivals and i love working with them so thank you asof for sponsoring this video i will have everything that i try on named on the screen sizes i usually get a 3x or the largest size available and i will have the links down below lastly i do have a coupon code which is d-white25 i'm not gonna hold y'all this week because this video <laughs> was not posted on thursday this week you'll see it on sunday this week so i do apologize about that but y'all we have some things coming into effect and all of this is just like you will see like everything is kind of just about to fall into place for us so as far as the schedule i will have to be strict with my youtube upload schedule so lifestyle will have to be on mondays or tuesdays and my fashion will have to be on thursdays or fridays once you know i get everything settled i will confirm that schedule okay so not that i'm quitting youtube or anything like that but i am becoming more strict about where i am prioritizing my time with interior design clients with thrifty slay clients with all of that as well as creating content so if you like i said if you've been watching my vlogs you'll see what i'm talking about but let's go ahead and hop in i did do this hair tutorial you guys know i have locks my natural hair is locked so um i crocheted faux locks and yeah i haven't seen many people doing it so i do have that video coming soon and then um i don't have oh yeah thrifty slay lashes these are new lashes they're not on the site yet but we will be launching this week coming up so let's hop into this haul without further or do so we have this set here me oh i love doing it <laughs> but no um so you guys can see the whole poof effect of the shoulders and all of that so i don't mind the bra look i actually would probably go with if i was to do not my mk bra which i will show you how it looks with my mk bra on but if I wanted to do something like this, like a lacy bra, I would definitely go cream or white because I feel like that will look better than the black unless I'm doing black accessories. Other than that, you know, a lot of people were saying they didn't see too many, you know, um, what would we call it? Like tops that showed a lot of the cleavage. So if this is what you're looking for, you have a lot of cleavage shown here. I have a balconette bra on, so it's not like a push up, push together bra. But anywho, um, I love this set. It's really comfortable. It's like a stretch linen material. Um, the waistband in the back has like the elastic, but in the front, it's just like a smooth effect. It does have pockets. This is given like it is given CEO, boss chick, all of that. Um, and then with the top, I personally would want it like, like maybe right there just personally. But like I said, with my MK bra, I would rock the ish out of this. So you do um, have control over the button so you can unbutton it here and here and, you know, open it. But I would definitely wear it closed in this scenario. But here is what the back is looking like. Don't mind my underwear. These are actually a shaper thong that I just reviewed. So if you guys have not seen that shapewear video, I do recommend it. But they do come up pretty high in the back. So, yeah, I would have to definitely kind of tuck them in or like pull them down a little bit but either way it does what it needs to do here because everything looks so so good it's not super duper flat and constricted and smooth but i do like the thong shaper under these pants here but that is this first set i love it it's really cool and comfortable i feel like it's perfect for spring and you could even wear it in the summer okay so here we have this top which i'm like do i take it off more Put it on more i'm not sure but either way we have this top which is like an off the shoulder top i also feel like it can be like a square kind of line top but um this is how it's looking it's like a floral i don't really wear small print florals but i think this is cute because it's not too much it's not like a long dress and even then i feel like sometimes you know some occasions calls for certain types of florals and things but i like the way this is done i guess you'll call it kind of in moderation because it is a crop top so it's not so overwhelming but i do like the length of it it gets kind of not snug but you can see it's kind of um, poofy up here, but then more fitted here, but it's not tight at all. So then, this is how the back is looking. Oh, watch this, y'all. Okay, uh, this 
stuck to my lip gloss. <laughs> but anyhow, this is how it's looking back here. You do have this tie, which you just, I just put it in a bow back there. Not sure how it was supposed to go, but that's how I did it. And yeah, I just kept those same pants on. And this right here is a fit too. I can see it with a white purse, a white heel. And yes, girl. Yes. And even like a cream hat. That would be a vibe. Okay. So y'all know I try not to hoard clothes and keep everything. But immediately when I put this on, I said, oh, I'm keeping this. <laughs> okay. So even if I don't wear it together, because I feel like the pieces are definitely workable separate. I want to wear this skirt with like a white top and maybe green or white accessories. Because if you just don't even look up here, the skirt is fire within itself again I'm just wearing that thong shaper that I recently reviewed and you guys have been loving that review so thank you so much for tuning in but I love this I love it and I love that the print isn't all over on the top well the print kind of is but not the color so you have the same color on the sleeves of it I thought it was real cool it reminds me of like lasers or like a neon spider web or something I don't know but it's definitely given and this skirt it's everything i think it's because it's tight all the way down and sometimes stuff gets kind of loose down there but i want it to be tight on the ankles so i love this midi skirt um and i still have my bra it's just like kind of taking off the shoulders a little bit but yeah and even the play on color is nice so here is how the back is looking so i'm definitely gonna wear this skirt it's like I love fun pants, I love fun skirts, and then maybe tone it down with the top of it, but yeah, y'all, this is this set. It is lightweight, it's spandex, so it's stretch all over. Alright, y'all, so this one kind of shocked me. Um, Half the time, like, I just glimpse, and I'll be like, okay, I'll try that, I'll try that. Other times, it's stuff that I might, you know, just have my eye on and really, really want, or things that I just think you guys would like, but I saw this, and I was like, okay, let me try that out. So, here, I didn't know it was, like completely see-through so I would probably do maybe nude underwear um hence why I went and got the nude version of the thong I think I got it in nude but anywho um I'll probably do nude and a nude bra or no bra just depends but I do like that you don't even have to lace it all the way up so if you wanted cleavage here you can just unlace some and then have your cleavage you know showing but I love this I think it's really really cute it's comfortable and I've really been into the half and half you know the half color let me see the back okay the color is half and half on the back too because sometimes it's just in the front but that navy one that I got last week y'all chef's kiss I love that dress I definitely was like I need it but yeah this trend is definitely for me <laughs> because I do like it um I will say I'm usually not too keen on front slits but this one isn't so bad because I don't feel like it goes up really really high so that's how this is looking it's not as heavy as that navy one I told you about but it's not super duper lightweight it has a nice weight to it this is how it's looking in the back I got to do that now. This is how it's looking. One thing I'm always appreciate as a person who typically does wear makeup if I'm going like, you know, on an occasion, I guess I'll say out on an occasion or for an occasion. So I love to be able to step into my dresses and this one I was able to step into, but I really love that this kind of looks like a two piece set for me immediately when I put it on, I'm like vacation or something it just gave me vacation vibes I don't know why it could be the blue it could be because it almost feels like naked you know it's really really lightweight here is like a spandexy material with a slight sheen to it and up here it's a stretchy material but it feels more cotton I love the way it cups the boob the cutout is really really nice so I really like this and then erosion you can control up here if you wanted to do that oh a little I like that um and then you can control if you want to take more down at the knees as well so yeah this dress is everything it just it's hugging it's giving I love it um and then it's not too much coverage now don't be talking about if my locks getting stuck in my clothes and whatnot um as you can see it is connected in the back so that's how that is looking okay so here we have this little number keyword little but this is a mini dress and i ain't even gonna hold y'all i had like one percent faith in this dress because i was like this is not gonna cover the butt this ain't gonna do nothing but ride up but 
I actually like it. I think it's cute. For me, it would be a layering piece. I would wear this, you know, really short, really dainty, and put on like a chiffon or, ooh, ooh, y'all. One second. And we back. <laughs> so, um, I was like, hold on real quick, like we on the phone. But, so, let me do a full 360 so you can see. It's definitely giving just summer dress vibes. Really, really short. Really dainty. And if you don't want to cover up with a duster or a jean jacket, don't do it. Don't do it. But for me personally, <laughs> I love these types of dresses when it comes to dusters like this. Or like floral or chiffon. You know, just boom bow and have it kind of hanging off and yeah and also i wanted to show you guys this because i got this from asof a while ago but look at that it's beautiful and this is definitely something i would throw on with maybe a rose gold heel some rose gold or clear accessories and yes ma'am so um i got this a long time like two three years ago not too long but two three years ago <laughs> so it's not on the site right now but asof Bring this back and bring it back in silver too. I need it, y'all. <laughs> Immediately when I saw this, I was like, yeah, okay. Like, cause, oh, girl, the coverage is like nothing in the back. <laughs> so I was like, what? But then I'm like, oh, then it makes sense why the cover up top or the top is like this. Um, It is optional. I'll try to get it under my hair. Okay, because I was like, my boobs, and I don't even have, like, the largest of the largest, so, girl. Then you do a little, well, bam, bam, and tie it up, and I'm like, okay, I like that, okay. I like that, because you still get cleavage and yitty action, but you still have, you know, some boom boom bam cover up and i was actually surprised in the coverage of the panty because when i first took it out i'm like i don't know how that's gonna be for me but y'all you got good coverage here this is all everywhere but you can see that's what it's like in the back so i specifically chose this bikini to pair with this because i thought it would look really really nice and it does look so freaking good with this cover up i freaking love this this is so cute and the cover-up is different i don't have anything like this usually it's just like a skirt or one long dress or something like that but i like this or like a kimono type vibe but this is how it's looking in the back so you still get the sexy aspect of it but then you still get you're not completely exposed like the boobies y'all saw how the boobies was looking so yeah i really really like this Wow, I knew I was forgetting something. So, heartbroken. All right, I can't even get it on the hanger right. But anywho, this pantsuit did not work for me. Blazer, fine. But the actual pants, it was like a no-go. So I was really heartbroken with this. Like, I might even still style it with like some white pants and a white top and like a blue purse and stuff just for some feed photos. But yeah, this didn't work and it's been really popular. The girls have really been wearing it. I saw the orange and pink version, but I was like, I want the blue and green. But yeah, beautiful like abstract tie-dye pantsuit, but and really well made. Like the material feels really, really high quality, but it didn't work for me sadly. So that's that. Yeah, I rolled my eyes because I'm upset. But yeah, that's how this looks. Oh. That's how this looks. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul this week from ASOF. Um, again, my coupon code is D-Y25. And I'll have all the links down below.